I'm Drew Broach from NOLA.com and the Times-Picayune. We're live here with all three U.S. attorneys for the state of Louisiana. Good morning. I'm Amy Joseph. I'm the United States Attorney for the Western District of Louisiana. And I'm Peter Strasser, the United States Attorney for the Eastern District of Louisiana. I'm Brandon Freeman. I'm a U.S. Attorney for the Middle District of Louisiana. Today, Mr. Strasser was uh, installed as the new U.S. Attorney for the 13 Parish Eastern District of Louisiana. What, uh, what message do you have for the people of Southeast Louisiana in terms of being the Justice Department's point person here? Well, first off, the fact that all three of us are sitting here on the couch today shows uh, a level of cooperation that uh, one otherwise might not see. And that's the theme that I came forth in my talk this morning, that not only is it us, the three of us, on the federal level, but also cooperation very closely and very tightly with the state. In the Eastern District, we have 13 parishes. I've gone out and met with the sheriff of every single parish. I've gone out and met with the uh, police chief here in New Orleans. Uh, I met with the district attorneys, and all of us, as well as all the federal enforcement, law enforcement stacks, we're all on the same page, which is one team, one fight. Mm -hmm. What's the top priority for you now that you're the top law enforcement officer for the federal government? Well, that's very simple. Any violations of federal crimes are all our top priority. There's no such thing as one crime being lesser or more um, or more in a focus than any other. Okay. You announced your new leadership team today. You want to tell us about who those people are? Yes. Um, it's, it's a team of people who I believe are the ones who have the best trial experience in the office the most uh, maturity, wisdom, and judgment, and in fact are natural born leaders and managers. Uh, and they, these are names I think that are known well throughout the city. On the uh, civil side, it's Peter Mansfield and Sharon Smith to run the civil division. And on the criminal division, it will be uh, Rick Pickens who will be the chief of the criminal division. And then uh, working with him and more of a supervisory level will be uh, Fred Harper's executive assistant and uh, Michael Simpson as the first assistant. Are the challenges of the Eastern District any different from those of the other 92 U.S. Attorney's Office? Well, I don't know that it would necessarily be any different, but uh, we do have our own share of problems in New Orleans, as I noted in my talk this morning, uh, where the statistics vary. A recent one that I saw had New Orleans as being the 34th most dangerous city in the world and ranked as the fourth most dangerous city in the United States. And needless to say, that's part of the effort and the focus of one team and one fight to um, make those numbers change. Thank you again. This is Drew Broach at NOLA.com and the Times Picayune. We've been talking with Peter Strasser and his two colleagues, the other U.S. attorneys for the state of Louisiana.